What is happening, everybody? This is Cody, a.k.a. DFS Prodigy, coming to you live, breaking down this upcoming MLB 7-game slate. Like I said, I'm going to start to do some MLB videos whenever I can. It's been a busy work week. I've worked seven days straight so far. So we have no NBA tomorrow, so let's go and knock out this MLB slate. But before we begin, hit like button for me. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's going to turn you all know. So let's knock out, like I said, this MLB slate. So we're going to take it by position by position. So starting at pitcher, this is kind of an interesting uh, pitching spot for a lot of people. Um, up top, Clayton Kershaw. I love the matchup for him against Detroit. This should be an easy matchup. I trust him way more than I trust Gary Cole right now, just based on recent form. Eric Lauer, 9-6 is an okay option, but we don't have a lot of value plays. Um, Overton, I don't trust. I don't trust Watkins. Hernandez, I don't trust. I mean, Dan Dunning, I don't like this matchup for him. Maybe Bryce Elder against Texas, but we know Texas has a couple of big bats. Um, but the lowest I don't mind going to is Nathan Avaldi against Baltimore. I like the spot for him. I like the splits for him. I think he can certainly do well. He's looked good recently. I mean, he went for a seven innings last game against Detroit. I don't mind going to him at 8-7. But let's go over bat. So I catcher. I catcher. So I like... Travis Denarnold at 4-8. I like the spot for him. Mitch Garver, I don't mind if you want to hedge against um, Bryce Elder at 4-4. We know he's a big bat. I like his upside. Um, this just, I don't like a lot of other catching options. Maybe Austin Barnes, if he does start, we could certainly look at him. I think he, this is a good bounce back spot for him. First base, <coughs> we have a, a lot of good bats. I mean, Freddie Freeman, Rizzo, Olsen, Alonzo, Cron, Hoskins. There's a lot of good bats. Um, I, this is the spot I'm going to spin up for. If I'm going to spin up for somebody, it's going to be Freddie Freeman at 5-4. This is an excellent spot for him. Pete Alonzo, 5,000. like what he, I'm seeing, I think, especially against Gibson. If you're going to go lower, go to Nathaniel Lowe at 3-6. Again, it's just a hedge against Bryce Elder or Joey Votto at 3-4. I don't mind going to him whatsoever. Spencer Torkson, so we know he has homer upside. I do like that. Trey Mancini, if you want to hedge, hedge against Nivaldi at 2-8, that, that's, that's not a bad option either. Let's go to for let's go to second base now. Second base. So this is where I'm gonna kind of try to get different. As I like Jonathan India at three nine. I, I think this is an excellent spot for him. Colton Wong three eight. I, this is where I'm kind of spinning down for. Labor Torres three three is too cheap for him. This is where, like I said, I'm gonna try to kind of spin down for. But then at third, so at third, so third base is also kind of interesting to me. If you want to look at possibly. Brandon Jury or Bobby Witt. I do like Bobby Witt. I do like Abania's big power bat. I like Alec Baum at 3-4. Not a bad option either. This is where I'm kind of trying to get different. Shortstop. So shortstop, I don't mind going to Corey Seager at 4-7 as a hedge play also. Didi Gregorius, I like that at only 3-8. James B. Swanson, a big bat, 3-3. He's too cheap for him. That's where I'm kind of looking at. And then outfield. Outfield, so you're going to want to get a big bat out of the outfield. I don't mind going to Aaron Judge as another homer pick. I love the upside this kid brings at 5-5. Charlie Blackman against Overton. This is an excellent spot for Colorado. I like going to him. Possibly Gorchek. I like him at Colorado also. You can look at Crick. What, Merrifield? If you think Garrett Cole's not going to do well once again at 4-4, I like that for sure. Garcia at 3-9. Big bad also out of him. McCutcheon, speed for his steal upside. I like that. Hunter Renfro against Steele. Easily spot for him. Joey Gallo. A big bat also. I like that. So that's where I'm kind of looking at for this slate, guys. Again, thank you for tuning in. Hope you have a great safe rest of the night. Have a good one.